Hi, I'm Caitlin and I'm currently a fourth year student at the Royal Deck School of Veterinary Studies, University of Edinburgh. So here we are in the vet school itself. Let's go have a look. The vet school is currently taking a hybrid approach to online teaching, which means we still get plenty of time on campus. We have lots of amazing resources to learn from, such as these anatomy specimens and our fibroblast animals which I have just shown previously. This is The View, which is our on-campus cafe. This is where we eat our lunch between lectures and practicals, catch up and have coffee. There's lots of extracurriculars that are encouraged at the vet school. Look at all this amazing art our students have created. We're also right next to the Roslyn Institute, which means we have a fantastic opportunity to research and a particular focus on this. Each student has their own individual locker for their PPM. This is a statue of our founder, William Dick, who founded the vet school in 1823, making it one of the oldest vet schools in the world. In this video, I just want to give you a brief insight into what life was like as a vet student and what it's like as a student living in Edinburgh. So I hope you find this useful and I hope you enjoy. So I'm just starting my day off with some pancakes. It was actually pancake day when I filmed this and my flatmates made these for me. And then I'm just having a wee cup of herbal tea. So then I sat down at my desk and started my lectures for the day. They were on ferrets, which was super interesting and I really love learning about them. Then I just had a little look over my bullet journal. Um, I love bullet journaling. I think it's so helpful to keep track of everything and it's also a bit of a creative outlet. I have everything in here from my day-to-day -day week to my placements. After that, I headed to the gym with my lovely flatmates. Um, please don't laugh at my terrible run times. And we just had a bit of a stretch and a workout, which was really fun. So when I came home from the gym, I started packing my bag for vet school. I took my bullet journal, my pencil case, my locker key, my big folder of notes, and of course my laptop, which I'm gonna to use to take notes. This afternoon I had an on-campus tutorial and I also had an equine ophthalmology practical. So I'm packing lots of things like my highlighters I can use to take notes, as well as my AirPods, which I'm gonna use during the hour bus journey, just so I can listen to some audiobooks. I'm also going to take a pair of fluffy socks, which are great if you have to wear under your equine boots, and a little hat just to keep me warm because it's still quite a cool day out. And I'm ready to go. Then I just put on my outfit of the day for vet school, but without the slippers. Then I had a quick hot chocolate for vet school and had a wee chat and catch up with my flatmate before going in. <laughs> Then I just got the bus into vet school. One of the best things about living in Edinburgh is the fact there are so many bus routes up to the vet school and just bus routes everywhere in general. So it's really convenient to get anywhere and really easy. As you can see, the vet school campus is absolutely gorgeous. It was a lovely sunny day when I filmed this, not like most days in Scotland. And here we are. So here we are in the gorgeous atrium and then I just met up with some of my friends and had a quick chat with them before my tutorial. <laughs> then I headed to get changed and we headed down to the bottom barn for our equine ophthalmology practical. This was so fun and so useful. This is our lovely teaching horse Rosie who is a very willing participant in this video and also a great example for us to learn our ophthalmology on. Then I had a tutorial on small animal surgery for animals like gerbils and fish. My flatmate had made this lovely chipotle chicken salad for me coming in, so I had that for my lunch. And just had a wee look at the sunset, so pretty. Then I had the flat to myself, so I settled down at the kitchen table and I did some studying. I love the Pomodoro technique where you do 25 minutes on, 5 minutes off. I find that really helpful and helps keep my focus. Um, and I apologise for holding my pen so weird. Um, I don't know why I do that. Then my boyfriend came home, we made some dinner together, we just had a wee pizza because that's what we had in the fridge and we ate that together. Then we just sat down together, had a wee cup of tea and forced each other to study for a couple hours. Then I made us both some mug cakes for dessert which was so yummy. And then I just washed my face, brushed my teeth and I got myself into bed. Here I am all cosy. 
And of course, I had to finish with a wee clip of my dog, Holly. I hope this has been useful for you to see what life is like as a vet student. Thank you so much for watching.